Hello, if you're having this uh, little DJI Phantom 4 uh, gimbal issue where it uh, twitches kind of back and forth or it does a little gimbal dance as it might be called, I have possibly a solution. So as happened a few days ago, uh, it was like kind of months leading up to it. It was kind of making this like screeching sound, but I just like didn't really care. And eventually it started doing that shaking and like as I would be flying the drone or just turning it with my hand, uh, it would get way more drastic and go fucking crazy. Um, so what I ended up finding out was that it's either the uh, IMU in here, which kind of controls all of these uh, motors was bad or the actual yaw motor was bad, which is this motor up here. And uh, I had done all the call, I had done all, all the calibration stuff, and I had uh, uh, downloaded like an older version of the firmware, and we updated the firmware. Like I said, none of that worked. Uh, so I went to Reddit, uh, as you saw in this video here, posted that, uh, and essentially came to the conclusion that it's my yaw motor. So I took apart the gimbal. Uh, completely and eventually got down to this and that's my yaw motor right there and I noticed that like as I moved it and I sat back in place it was kind of like not aligned like like those two little screws weren't you know aligned with the uh, yaw arm you know, the back part of the arm it wasn't aligned um, anyways I, I just noticed that and I, I moved on uh, I ended up taking out the motor which is it looks like looks like this and it ended up taking it out uh just that and i tried to get the top the casing off it like that that metal piece right there like the whole metal top part comes off uh to in, in order to see in there and clean it and also possibly order a new motor because if you order order a new motor you have to use your original casing so you have to get it off anyways so that's what I I was trying to do. I was just beating on it. I don't have a vice or like a punch to get it out like the videos were showing. So I was just beating on it. I ended up dropping it in concrete. I said, I'm just gonna give up because I have, I use this for work. So I, I had work tomorrow to do. So I'm just gonna put it all back together. But as a Hail Mary, what I did, and this is the uh, solution, possibly, one of these three things did it. So, all the banging on it, that was one. I don't know if that did anything. Two, uh, I don't know if I still have it. I oh, know I don't. I have a, I had a can of compressed air. Um, and I just, sh I just like, like there's a little like seam on the bottom of that motor and I just sprayed as much as I could in there. Just went crazy on it. And then also what I did was that little, this, this kind of thing right here when it was like not aligned what I actually moved it back in place was the ribbon. In the video, I don't show it, but like that ribbon right there, like the part that goes like down, um, it like bends and that is what's snapping it back to like the center. So like when I move this right now and it goes back to the center, that's the ribbon. So what I did was, since I noticed it was too far one way, I like kind of pinched the ribbon, didn't put too much force on it, but like pinched it to kind of make it centered. So I did that as well. Um, I put it all back together and I turned it on just for shits and giggles, even though I didn't think that it'd work. And usually like right here, it starts shaking. Like right now, it'd be shaking like crazy. Uh, look at that video, but now so it, makes some, it makes some noises, but it doesn't shake anymore. So I'm assuming either something was stuck in there and the air got it out or me hitting it, got it out, or that little, that ribbon in there that was pushing it one way, maybe, maybe it was too much force and it was like fighting it, going back and forth. I'm not 100% sure, but that's what fixed it for me. I'm not sure if it's a temporary fix, it might come back, I, I have no idea, but I'm hoping this helps. Some other knowledge that I learned was, uh, Yeah, actually, they, you know, that's about it. <laughs> that's about it. Uh, these yaw motors I was looking at, they're like 50 bucks, kind of everywhere on eBay, mainly where you would find them. And uh, if, you, if you actually do need to replace it, one guy that I did find, his name's Ted Kaiser. He seems to be uh, 
pretty knowledgeable and was a good video. It was a good find, has really low views. Um, and yeah, I would watch him. It's a Ted Kaiser uh, video two, that's what it is. And yeah, hope this helps you if you're having that little gimbal twitch. Um, that's it, good luck.